Migrants living at a shelter in Yonkers were arrested this week, accused of being violent with staff members. But as CBS 2's Jennifer Bisram reports, some migrants claim that things are being stolen from their rooms by security. How are you feeling? I feel bad. 22-year-old Albany Argate is a mother of two and migrant from Venezuela who has been living at this emergency shelter in Yonkers since she arrived in New York in September. $600. She tells CBS2 during random room checks at the Ramada Inn on Tuckahoe Road, her money and electronics were stolen, and she's not the only one. <laughs> Ken Tarnal, a migrant from Venezuela also living at the shelter, was arrested Tuesday for disorderly conduct. There's a guy in Novio Anguli. He's getting very violent with everybody. <laughs> He's throwing stuff at everybody. It happened after a dispute between migrants and staff. Police body cam video shows Arnal pulling away from officers and this woman blocking the police car door. Police say at one point she attempted to strike officers. She too was arrested. Arnal says he acted out because he's fed up with his rights being violated. They enter our rooms without knocking. They enter, search through our personal belongings when we aren't there, our money and jewelry. The individuals that we're talking about and what's happening at the Mermada Inn uh, appears to be limited to a, a few people who just, frankly, aren't happy with some of the rules. Rules include no unsafe appliances like hot pots in the rooms. Police say officers responded to over 100 dispute calls at the shelter since last May when over 250 migrant families moved in. We're told no complaints of theft were made, but it's now being investigated. We're not dealing with, with, with crime. We're dealing with disputes. We're trying to just obviously defuse disputes. Uh, there's a couple people that, uh, that aren't happy with certain situations, certain rules. We reached out to West Hab, the organization that runs this shelter. We were told no comment at this time. In Yonkers, Jennifer Bisram, CBS 2 News.